New at five now, an emotional story of an Albanian mother who illegally came to the United States 13 years ago and now was involved in a deportation fight. She says she originally came to the U.S. because she feared for her life. 7 Action News reporter Ronnie Dahl shares her story and what this means for her children. That's her blanket. Look, look at her as she's sleeping, us, trying to sleep over. Instead of presents under the Christmas tree, Seal Prechetta's children have suitcases packed and ready to go to a place they have never been and know nothing about. I'm moving to a new country. There's new, um, there's a new language, and it would be pretty embarrassing because, like, I would have to relearn everything from pre preschool Albania. They coming here to the poor mother, threatening me. You have to leave the country. Seal has created a new life in Troy since fleeing Albania in 2000. She got married, had three kids, but now is on the verge of losing it all. I apply so many times. I spend, I work so hard and I spend me and my husband just trying to get my papers and they always denied me. Seal sought asylum, saying she was afraid of being sold into a life of prostitution. America was her place to start over, but her request was denied after countless pleas to stay. Her time in Troy may be up. She was given a 24-hour notice and told to be at the airport Tuesday morning for deportation. She didn't go and now she waits. Her family is living in limbo, worried any minute immigration officers will come and find them. Late this afternoon, a spokesperson for ICE did tell me that at this time, SEAL's removal from the country is not imminent and they are reviewing her case. Ronnie Dahl, 7 Action News.